Welcome ladies and gentlemen, today we have some good news for you regarding PlayerUnknown's Battlegrounds first person only. These servers are coming to Battlegrounds in the team's next monthly update for August. Hey, this is a good thing, right? And of course we'll be keeping our third person servers that we play on right now. That said, I have witnessed many Battlegrounds players broadcasting their concerns regarding the third person in its current state. Fellow Battlegrounds content creator Hayes has been vocal on this issue for quite some time, as well as some larger content creators like Summit and Dr. Disrespect. Spect. Spect. Oh yeah, I enjoy watching a bit of the doc. As for myself, I would be the first to admit that I'm shockingly shite at first person only mode, mainly due to the bad habits I've picked up and rely on since early access started with the third person only servers. Of course there may also be the lack of skill on my part, but the field of view does need adjusting. I really hope a field of view slider is something that comes first and foremost when first person only is delivered in August's monthly update. The low field of view at the moment, which is I would guess around 55, really makes me feel nauseous. I'm not the only person who has mentioned this, and it makes it really uncomfortable and not enjoyable to be honest in its current state when using it in custom game modes. Which is probably the main reason, if not the only reason, that I haven't played as much first-person custom game modes as I could have. I don't know how many of you may have seen Summit's entertaining rant regarding third-person view, regarding a skilled ninja-like player taking out all players around him, then just to be taken down by somebody stood behind a wall, with another pair of eyes three foot to the right, looking around the wall and waiting for his moment. Of course, this will not be possible in first-person only mode, and it is where skill comes to the forefront in our gameplay. There's nothing more frustrating than being killed by somebody that could see you, and you couldn't see them because they were hiding behind a wall and using the third-person camera to their advantage. Personally, I will be moving to first-person only, as I like to do in DayZ also, to avoid being exploited using a third-person camera. That's not to say that third-person servers are bad, but more for casual players, I guess. Those that want that true, skill-based experience are going to go first-person only all the time. There isn't really much else I can say on this subject without ranting on and repeating myself. I'll finish with me talking and leave you with some third-person tactical espionage footage with a quote from Player Unknown regarding first-person. We will bring first-person only to EU and NA solo and duo games first, and once we have polished the system, we will expand to other regions. Check me out on Twitter if you haven't already for all the latest infos, and throw me a follow on Twitch if you want to watch me get wrecked by noobs. Links are in the description below, and I'll see you peeps next time. Boom. Oh, shot to me, shot to me. Where's uh, that from? From the north. From the north. Maybe on high rise. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I see him. <laughs> Come on. Okay. I'll give you um, five septic coins if you win him over on that bike. <laughs> One hit. Nice. Two hits. Ooh. Nice. Still a whole squad of the mushroom. He died straight away, didn't he? Mm hmm. One down. I might as well move him. Oh. Yeah, that's on me. Nate totally didn't scare me. Hey. Nice ass shot. Nice. You seen you? Oh, maybe not. Oh, that's a stupid revive decision. 
Mm. We definitely got no smoke. Nope. I think he's taking fire. How many kills did you get, Septic? Uh, seven. I did not expect to win that though. Nice. <laughs> Got nice, six there. Nice. nice, nice, 